Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Marvel's Midnight Sun Let's Play. We have some hangouts tonight, hey you. and this is the first time we can hang out with Captain America. We actually have a couple of his legendary gifts, Avenger number 4 comic book, where he appears, so let's hang out with him. So, I think deep conversation something he likes or loves. It just struck me. Your first time in New York City was the day of your resurrection. Not my first time. I traveled there in my youth. That must have been a shock to find it so much bigger and louder. Trust me, I know the feeling. There is an energy to the place that has not changed a bit. Yeah, you notice it right away. I grew up in Brooklyn. Whenever I'm away, that's the Big Apple I remember. Do you miss it now? Every day. But in the face of a greater threat, we don't always have the luxury of going home. Alright, three points, not so bad at all. And where is that comic book? There it is. The Return of Captain America. You're so thoughtful, Hunter. I think we maxed out here. Love the activity, conversation plus three. Love the gif, 20 points. All right, he's gonna level up next morning. Uh, he's gonna ask us to speak with him. I think he's pretty easy character to increase friendship given that he's just gonna be the light side of conversations. No orbs here. There's a couple chest respawns. I just want to grab all the orbs we can before we go out and grab those. We still haven't advanced the story enough to unlock Shaw's church to advance our word of power, sort of. Which is fine. We'll eventually get there. We've been making pretty good pace on the main story. We didn't do it the day before because we haven't finished our research. So let's quickly hop to it. We have a few places to go. The altar to give the offering. We got a wand. First time getting that, so maybe we'll get something else. But well, this looks like it belongs here. Key is fine. It seems my offering was accepted. I'll take the key. Hmm, almost missed that. Not much, a lot of gloss. Time for bed. You have not set anything on fire today, have you? I think we already maxed out our friendship with him, but um, still like to pet the dog. Here to gloat, Mother? Quite the opposite. I was concerned. I could not sense you after... Your pet monster nearly destroyed me. An unintended and unforeseen consequence of your continued assault against me. 
The mystical energies within our blood do not always mix well with off-worlders. But neither do the wards of your pretentious sorcerer. The Venom creature is a calculated but necessary risk. Alien monstrosities, Wanda's unchecked powers, coupled with Banner's unhinged mind. Whatever you are planning, Mother, I fear it may be beyond even your control. Your concern touches me, but I would risk the heavens themselves if it meant saving you. I do not need saving. Oh, but you do. And that crack in your collar is the first step. Every revolution of self starts with the tiniest of rifts. An ever-so-slight splinter in the glass. A hanging thread begging to be pulled until it unravels all. You should be celebrating. That crack is the beginning of your emancipation from my sister's control. She keeps you collared because she fears you. They all do. Sarah wants to hold you back from realizing your full potential. The way she tried to hold me back centuries ago. I would not need this collar had I not been corrupted by your blood. Is that what you believe? Oh, child. There is so much you must learn. But you would never believe me if I told you. Not here. Not now. You must discover those answers on your own. Once you're unshackled, you will finally be free to be yourself. And who is that? Answer me! I mean, I'm grabbing these light balance points, but I see that Lilith has a point here. Still pretty committed to our light playthrough. Summon Charlie. Our dedication of the light has our new ability Summon Charlie. We can call him into combat. So we are rewarded here by specializing. There's a book club meeting invite. There's a bunch of things. Let's see. A couple guys needs help in our conversation. That is normal. Research is ready. Book club tonight. And let's talk to Steve. The mirror table, our pulse on everything Hydra, really brings an Avengers Tower vibe to this place. It has been useful. The Abbey always harbored great resources, but Stark and the Doctor have enhanced its abilities tenfold. Don't get me wrong, Tony and the other Steven are great, but I believe in giving credit where credit is due. You've also been doing your fair share, and I wanted to let you know that it hasn't gone unnoticed. That is a generous compliment to give. Thank you, Captain. It's not generous when it's true. They say a good soldier should always trust his gut, and if my gut is right, and it's almost always right, I think you have a destiny beyond just defeating Lilith. And what destiny is that? Keep playing it straight with me, Hunter, and maybe I'll trust you enough one day to tell you. Alrighty. Our complement value increases to six. And let's see. We can continue Hunter, with we our have finished day. the symbiote sampling device. Come to the forge to have a look. We will. Peter. What's wrong? Stark and Strange are deciding what to do about Eddie. You think they'd ask, you know, the only guy who gets what Eddie's going through. That sucks, dude. You okay? I'm fine. It's Eddie I'm worried about, as well as the rest of you. But I guess I'm not qualified to handle this because I'm not an Avenger. Men that powerful think they have all the answers. Well, they're making a big mistake leaving the Venom expert out of their plan to stop Venom. I know how to get through to him, and how to keep him from hurting anyone. I'd never forgive myself if that happened. You tell him, Peter. Maybe I will. Oh, hey there, Hunter. Don't mind me. No one else does. Ooh, Strange Tales. Doctor Strange Gift. Iron Man Fan Fiction. 
Iron Man gift. Serenity, calming your inner demon. I think Ghost Rider? Let's go to the forge. Hey, uh, hey, can I ask a favor? You want a hangout? F for sure. If Thanks, we can get a hangout at night in three days, we'll bring Iron Man on oh, every mission. You are going to love this. Hero challenges. Let's do this. Here you are, Hunter. One symbiote sampler. Hot off the old demonic presses. That is not what I expected. Yes, I for one am not going anywhere near that thing. You're a doctor. Don't tell me you're afraid of a little needle. That is most certainly not a needle. Well, you say tomato, I say one gamma-infused arc-powered laser tomato. Either way, we're good to go. Now we just have to get close enough to Venom to use it. And I suppose you have a plan for that, too? Actually, I don't. Been too busy wrangling our friendly Forge Demon while ignoring Strange's advice in order to build a one-of-a-kind gamma-powered symbiote extractor that burns hot enough to pierce the sun. But basically, we just need to stick the pointy end in him and let the device do the rest. Once we jab that thing, the symbiote will be extracted and stored within the chamber. The fluid inside should maintain the sample's molecular integrity indefinitely. I, uh, based it on the saliva he left on you during that last round. I see. And does Spider-Man, Peter, think it will actually work? I'm not sure. To be honest, I've kind of been keeping him out of the loop on this one. Look, Peter's a great kid. With a big heart. He looks at Venom, and he doesn't see the same mucus monster we do. All he sees is Eddie Brock. From what he's told me, the two of them weren't exactly best friends before the symbiote got thrown into the mix. But that doesn't matter to Peter. It's not going to be easy to get that sample. We'll have to get real close. I know Peter would give anything, including his own life, to save Eddie. Guess I just don't want to see him distracted when the time comes. Look what happened to me with Bruce. Venom is not Banner, Tony. And Peter is not you. Well, that's the point. I... I look at Peter and I see... Well, maybe the person I could have been if I didn't let money, fame, and my dad's war profiteering get the best of me. Maybe I just want to keep the kid... a kid... for as long as possible. Tony... End of the day, we gotta find Venom first before any of this matters. Given his symbiote is happily sliming its way across the five burrows, it's gonna be hard getting any kind of reading on him with conventional means, as in the non-demonically possessed kind. Thankfully, there's always Auntie Caretaker and her magic mirror. I'd check in with her. Talk to you soon, Hunter. All right. Give me our legendary... Welcome to Tony's Scary Demon Cave. I'm Tony, and how may I assist you? coil. Give us our card. Something legendary, please. This is some of my best work. No legendary cards? What is this? Hmm. We have an upgraded call to arms, so we're probably not going to use this. It's a free play. For the upgrade, but it's only one turn, which we like. Mm, this is not great. I mean, this is good for all the combos we want. We want the redraw. We want the draw and the redraw for Iron Man. We got a version without this. One resist, cure, on redraw, gain 75 block. Definitely strong, but this this feels pretty good too. And it becomes free, but we don't get any heroism when playing this card if it's free. I 
guess this would be it. A little disappointed we didn't get any legendary card, but I guess we can use our blueprint for that if we want that. I see Tony showed you his new toy. He did. He is so in love with his toys. I don't suppose he's given much thought as to who should get close enough to Venom to use it? If anyone understands Venom, it is Peter. He might be a good candidate for this mission. The ability to put ourselves in our enemy's shoes can tell us where they have been and where they are going. Peter, interesting. His innate humanity and unwavering empathy for Eddie Brock's plight could make him an ideal candidate. This won't be figured out right now, but we should decide something soon. Time is of the essence. But I suppose you know that better than anyone. We will talk again soon. All right. Feels like that mission's gonna end up being Spidey, me, and Iron Man. And we should prepare for that. How are you, Peter? You tell me, Hunter. I'm out of the loop on everything. They're off discussing what to do about Venom, and no one has said a word to me about it. I apologize if you were left out of the loop on this, Peter. If it is any consolation, I do not think it was meant to be malicious. Everyone's as freaked out as I am. They just bury it way down deep and then walk around like they've got something stuck in their armor. There is no one better suited for a mission against Venom than you. I know. I should be doing something. Because right now I feel kind of useless. Maybe I'll use the forge to bake a loaf of sourdough. Really get in Stark's way until he notices me. If you want Stark to pay attention to you, there are better ways to make your point than making bread. Well, I was kidding about that, but if you have suggestions... Just walk up to him and suggest a way to help. Okay, okay, you've made your point. Ah, <sighs> fine. Maybe I'll speak up. Excellent. Just give me a bit. I'm a little rusty. The Sinister Six caused me to miss out on my speech class final. Alrighty, so... Free gift. We still have a dialogue over here. I want to ask Bruce for help, and then I remember that, no, that's not an option anymore. We're missing something, Hunter. And the frustrating thing is it's happening right in front of us. Where? The Sanctum is filthy with Hydra. Too many of them. It wouldn't take many guards to secure the building. So the question is, what else are they doing in there? There is only one way to find out for sure. And to do that, we need to get inside. That's not going to happen until we get a sample from Venom. Our list of problems continues to grow longer. Well, we're not here for the easy stuff. All right, so I think we're ready to go. Uh, we haven't done the forge part. Not forge, the training part. Let's see, daily spare critical damage. Um, oh, Iron Man's injured, okay. Critical, critical, critical. We have two injuries, that's terrible. Um, well, you know what they say about he practice. already has a bonus, so not him. Let's just my lucky day, huh? Give it to Captain Marvel. Let's do. I still say time's wasting, Hunter. We had one of these, huh? Right now we can get the upgrade. We're gonna heal up our man. We need essences again. 
Don't see any orbs laying around. At least not enough. Let's see. Alright, no chest. I think it's just time to pick up a mission. We will get Spidey up to speed. Maybe have him do a mission to pick up some cards for him. Just want to check orbs real quick. Nope. Okay. Right. The main story mission would be Spidey here. Nothing's easy. Get some epic. Blueprint's not what I want. None of these missions have what I want. As in more essences. I kind of want to bring Iron Man to this. I kind of want to get Spidey ready for this. Blueprint. I'm going to go with credit. Blade has been pretty strong, but we need Spidey to pick it up a little bit. Pick up a few more cards for him, and then we'll tackle the main mission once Iron Man comes back. We'll run that team. Might be a little expensive in terms of heroism, but we should be okay. Hydra forces in this area are causing trouble. Let's take them down. We can definitely handle that. I'm not so sure. All right, get disabled truck environmental attack bonus, which is good for Spidey. We got a counter. Get to the trucks and grab those artifacts before they roll Luke out. Slash. So we have the recovery car for that one right off the bat. Spidey sands draw a couple. Let's draw a card with this first. They have one sniper. He's gonna go invisible, isn't he? I mean, that's totally fine. These two can just be taken out with a shove. I want this one first before we do any environmental attack. It's 336, 336, big shield. He needs to die so we can get his truck. We have a quick, which doesn't really do much. The heal we probably want to save. I don't think we're using this right away. Up to 243 damage, not enough. We'll start with a draw. I'm on it. Nice. Let's do this. Hmm. Forceful could be good. We could also chain this, but he's not visible for this part of the chain, which makes it a little bit trickier. No one nearby. I mean, we're trying to see how to efficiently do this, and I don't think any of this is that efficient. Redraw that. That's not bad. That's actually not bad. We can get two stacks of bleed on each of them. We can get four stack on each if we want, but I can't, oh, I can't tag him. Okay, so in that case, two stack on him, two stacks on him. You've made a mistake. So well, it's four stacks. Each hit is two stacks. Punisher must get along really well. Oh, we didn't do the card that sets up the bleeds, but that doesn't actually trigger. My bad there. Hundred and thirty damage. Hydra didn't train you for this, huh? 
trying to figure out how we can apply too weak. I guess I would want to apply it on him. He's not at full health anymore, so we get extra damage. Here we go again. Never seen that before. Not the greatest first turn. I think we'll be okay. We can use one redraw. Maybe this card goes away. We wasted the combo because I thought his card comes with bleed, but that's just not true. Blaze Storm, I don't think we'll get a chance to use. I might discard this for a move. That way we can shove him and just kill him. Yeah, getting rid of our legendary card. There we go. We serve until the end. Alright, he's just aiming. That's good. Keep an eye on that one. Not enough. Let's see how tough it's you fine. Are. We have the guard card in our hand. We should have enough shielding Support building up. On the move. We can disable the truck so that we don't have to worry about it for a while. We're on top of it. That Our entire hand. Out. You're running out of time. No, we're not. We're gonna do this. I should slow them down, but it won't stop them. Get to the artifact before they figure out what happened. All right, we can chain it from him, but that's the only kill we can get. So we need a little bit more. No one's trying to hit me except for him. We just don't have enough heroism. That could solve it a little bit. I feel more like myself every day. All right, so first things first, we want to get him close to the execution point from Spidey's move. One thirty. Okay. Technically, we need the pull. I'm gonna heal just so we can draw cards. The light is on our side. Welcome, assistance. All right, we got what we needed. We're gonna use the move first to reposition so we can knock the guy out of his invisibility. That's efficient too. One two punch combo. We lost our first target for this. But now I kind of just want more quick slash kills. 135. I don't think this is worth it. We can't. They're not low enough. So I'm going to redraw this one. Wish we had bleed stacks. We can save that for the combo later. One. That can be a quick kill. 130. But we're not in position to do so. No one has the angle. 
I can't hit him. Put him at 150. It's not enough, and we end up using another one of our heroism. We drop him to 138. We can guarding strike him just to kill him. Use up our car. And then we can start using that environmental setup next turn. We waste our gain of heroism if we do it that way. So I think we we play this just for the heroism boost. The advantage is mine. So I think he gets killed by this shot. But uh I think that's how we will deal with this for now. Resist it. Oh, maybe he can resist a hit. That would be great. Or not. 238. Oh, he's dead, even without the snipe. We have a friend down. Finally, it's my turn. Well, that's not good. Oh man, more Hydra incoming! Hmm. So it might be a bit rough. Oh, dibs on the biggest Hydra goon. You're gonna have to start with this again. I'm up. Quick kick. Can't get damage on anyone else after the kick, though, which is a bummer. We're not gonna wait for that combo. Okay, we're gonna do this just to wake the hunter up. You kissed the mother with that. We really need his cards. We got a lot of quick slashes here that we can use. This one has draw. Even if it doesn't hit him, it's fine. I don't want to waste the move. I need a card Nailed here. That. Make them bleed. That's what we need. Okay, so that was a free play. Let's get this not discarded again. And then we're going to get this that card back help. again because I want another draw. He does go invisible here. But I think he's back to aiming. Wait. Even for Hydra. It's a little late for hiding. That's a good combo if we can pull, peel this card from his dead body. I could Guardian Strike him, get the card, Opportunism plus that card play, and then it's Environmental Heaven, but we don't have a good positioning on any of the environmental attacks, so. Not sure if it's worth that much card play combo here. We're very healthy despite getting targeted like crazy. No one's going after Blade, so we'll be able to survive. Wait for his combo. We conceal here and somehow kill him. All right, we do try to kill him then. I think that's the right play. We want to play that card. You are lucky to still be breathing. Uh, I don't know if it matter who plays it. I don't think it does, but just in case, it doesn't matter. We all get it, and then we're gonna get two moves to reposition, here we go. and basically gonna use environment to kill people here. Let's see. We can use this to kill him. Does 300 damage now. Oh, this should be good. We have a couple more moves. I can't make him visible. And this is a vault. This is not a... Yeah, so I guess we're out of options in this regards. But I can, I can redraw this. We take a hit from him. 
Wasting our two move feels really bad though. Hmm, yeah, we can't do anything here. It's only this and this. We resisted the vulnerability? No, we still got tagged. In the shadows. Okay, oh, resisted oh, maybe the days. Reinforcements on approach. There's a lot of reinforcements. We stand with the mother. No issues so far. We almost have the combo. We would depend on what card we draw here. I can't get that angle right. I think it's worth making a move. We can move to here. Was that truly your best? And then this way the sniper can't even target me. That's one hell of a move. There was a time when Lilith had the highest of standards for We have to kill him now. That time has clearly passed. Whitey gets picked. We're gonna see if we can get the bleed going. Should get the blood pumping. We got Daywalker. I kinda wanna bleed him four times, because it will actually go through his defense. Push me too the bleed far. damage. Blade's really good at countering shielded units. Well, I know I've never run into a vampire in New York. Alright, so now if I just... I don't have the card to pull the bleed, but if I... If I apply the bleed with a strike... No, we only have one card play left. We kill him. And then... Someone damp... So I'm gonna redraw one first. We're not going to use this. Hmm, not what I was thinking. We do get increased damage. It's not worth it. I'm on it. I saw a move like that Interrogate? Once, centuries ago. Hmm. That's a free play. I don't need this right now. We'll play this. We're fine. It's only one hit on Spidey. And it's not a big deal. Never surrender. Hey, that hurts! Someone call for reinforcements? Alright, three grunts. No one will touch you. He's visible. Let's get 250. This I think we start with the interrogate here. Go ahead. Try and hold out. That's a pretty good reward. Two cards. His body gets hit. Quick, quick. I mean, this will wake up Spidey and makes things a lot easier for us. Watch close. It's weirdos like these that give people like us a bad reputation. I can spin a redraw on this. Wait, on redraw get plus 40. I guess we have to get it back. It's not like Iron Man cards where it stays with us. Looks like it's up to me. 
Save some for the rest of us. This angle might be good for this. 175, not enough to kill him. And then he goes invisible. I don't need the heal, I don't need the mark. I don't need that either. Uh, probably not what we need either. We can't kill him. Still free for him. We'll take it. Coming at you. It's gonna camouflage afterwards. And then we're just gonna hide from me. I think Blade Storm can knock him out of that. So there therefore he dies. I had hoped for a challenge. Very expensive kill, but... Starting to see why they call you the hunter. Another interrogate. Spidey can take the hit. And we can't kill him, so... Tell us what you know, fiend. Uh, that was not the intention. I was supposed to select this. Waste of a move, but I guess it's fine. It wouldn't have killed him. The extra move would be another shove, maybe one-two punch. Maybe at a hundred something. Spidey almost died. We need the card to pop him with bleed. I and mean, it's slowly killing him, but it's a little too slow. Nothing to worry about. Alright, we need to kill the one who's targeting Spidey. We can heal him. On redraw cure. I'm afraid the redraw will make us actually redraw the card and we have to draw it back again. I'm okay if it, see if they have an answer for I'm this. okay if it doesn't doesn't kill him right away because I can easily get rid of the days. And that got the days out. Okay, so we're good. Um three seventy. We don't have any knots. Oh, we do have two quick. This kills him. Don't blink. It sounds to me like they just missed their mama. He's gonna hit Blade. Blade's fine. I'm fine. Spidey's not fine. Target has bleed extra damage. It's not worth it. Just to save Spidey from getting killed, this is probably the, the move. He has one... Yeah, I mean, we could do this and this and... Oh yeah, let's do that actually. We have enough car plays to pull this combo out. I think so now I can get the quick and get the extra heroism from the attack. Hydra's standards have fallen a great deal. And then we can also kill him if we want, or we don't have to because I can tank the damage and instead we can use this. And I assume we might be able to keep this card. Well, it's not a attack card, never mind. 
so that we can burst him a little bit harder here. Get him. Well executed. All right, I think we're good. I don't think the extra move is a shove. Yeah, it's not a shove, so it's fine. The battlefield is ours. Yeah, we can resist that. No big deal. That's not supposed to hurt. My time is shine. I'm alpha reinforcing. All right, now the fight becomes a lot easier. It's all about getting the items. Ooh, what a hand. What a hand. Uh, let's do this combo. Come get it. I'll put this to good use. And we're gonna first daywalker and mark everyone with health. Oh, there's only four of them. But we can double bleed one. We can double bleed him. Now we're doing this. I'm not really into guns, but you Then we're going to mark and also heal. And now we can consume and kill, but only one card play, so we want to do all our quick first. Uh, let's see. Reposition here. Draw a card. Everyone's gonna be dead by the end of this turn, so it's fine. Hail that. Well, that's not good. Cause that's not You know, you're pretty good at this. That's not a kill. That would be called a mistake. Should have reapered first. And just killed him. I mean, he does explode, he targets spike. No one dies. It's not a big mistake, but it's a mistake. They are being reinforced. All right, I think we'll be okay after this. Even I have limits. Now you're fine. They're all marked, so... We just needed to get kills last time. We just didn't get kills. 160... Yeah, I could just kill him. That would have been... He was marked. Do this. Would have gotten the card play back. Okay, that was pretty cool. Of course, we can interrogate. Um... We can use the card play, it's fine. I can handle this one myself. Alright, could Spidey's web throw? And up here even. Can kill everyone here for one card play. Blade takes a bit of damage afterwards. I mean everyone's targeting Blade, so Yeah. This is fine. This might sting a little. It is almost graceful the way you swing through the air like that. He's dead. Um, how do we kill him? We can do this. What? Ooh, I like it. We need to draw the other card to all to pick up the other supply? Got an artifact. That's not artifact, that's that's cash. Nope, not getting that card. Guess we're not done. Still not getting that card. I may be immortal, but I'm not indestructible. Here it comes. 
They cannot possibly match your strength. I mean, we probably want to. Oh, we got it. We got it. Uh, but we probably want to kill everyone first, just for the sake of it. Maybe you should teach oh, me that interrogate. Way. Oh no. Okay, that was he awesome. is just healthy. I guess we don't have to kill everyone, but we have still three car play left. Let's uh, let's kill him. Who's next? I am impressed. One two punch. Uh, his body Maybe spun out of the, this, this dimension. Twenty-five skill essence. We'll take that. I'd say that was a very successful outing. Good work. Yeah, all things considered, not too bad. Misplayed halfway in there, and then we also lost a hero. Slow, so one star. We'll take it. A lot of intel, a lot of credit. Two gamma coils. I need to hang out with Iron Man, so we need to do a couple missions with him to get that hangout event. Three days, right? So that's day number one. He's healing, so we can't hang out with him. So we gotta do some sort of mission with him in the next two days, hopefully back to back. So that we can finish his request. Yeah, no hangouts tonight. This is is this book club? This is book club. Yep, this is book club. So we'll have a book book club meeting. Get that out of the way, and then have Tony healed. We'll do a mission with him. Get his hangout out of the way, and then we'll go pick up Venom sample. We'll train Spider Man along the way so that he's ready for that big fight for him. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.